Hi, this is Pierre Delacote working at Planet Technologies. Do you know in OneDrive, when you browse OneDrive through your um, browser, um, for example, let's go to uh, chat files. So th there's a folder whenever I uh, chat with somebody or, s or some people and I drop a file, it will be stored in, in this folder in OneDrive. Um, but uh, what I wanted to talk about is there's a feature where you can see for any document. Um, let's pick one document, for example, this one. When you select the document, you can use this little icon on top of the screen and you will see some details and you will see actually who viewed your document. Um, so it's pretty, pretty useful because when you share a document you might want to know who had access to this document. But how do you do that in SharePoint on Teams since SharePoint and Teams are the same since uh, Teams is using SharePoint. So let's go here um, so if to do that, you need to uh, go in the file, whenever, whatever uh, channel you are in, you, you can pick up uh, any channel and open in SharePoint. The, the goal is to go into the sh SharePoint assigned to, the, to this uh, team. And then you go to these settings. And here you can go to site information. This is a little trick. And then you click on view all set site settings. So you will go to the admin page. Uh, you need to be the owner of the team to do that. And this will be here in site action, manage site features. And in manage site features, um, if you scroll down, it will be a SharePoint uh, viewer feature to activate. So you see this feature, if you select it, if you activate it, it will display to site members the names of people who viewed the file. So I'm going to activate that and then I'm going to go back to my uh, SharePoint site. I'm going to see all my uh, all my channels, so let's pick up one channel. I don't know which one I have documents in. Do I have document here? No, I don't have document. Uh, let's find a channel with document. Maybe general channel will have documents. Okay, so now when I select a document, I click on the icon here, and here I'm going to see who viewed the document. So pretty easily, I can activate. If I don't activate this feature, I won't see that. So that was a tip. Um, if you want to activate who has accessed, who viewed your document that you shared in, in Teams or SharePoint, this is a process to activate it. In OneDrive, it's already done. So I uh, hope it was helpful.